Good morning, everyone. It's me, Michael, and I'm going to give you guys my feedback video on the recent MWE show that I went to two weeks ago. I am going to give you guys three of my favorite matches. But before I get to that, I must bring this up because something happened two weeks ago that I'm going to bring to your attention. As I posted on my personal Facebook page, um, during a six-man tag team match, the wrestlers was like, was telling fans to move out of the way because they're going to do a dive from over the top rope. And whatnot. And um, so apparently the wrestlers was just doing the dive off the top rope and whatnot. Um, the rest, that um, six man tag team match was great. So as I, as myself and my friends was returning to our seats, um, some fan was sitting in my friend's seat. So I politely asked him to move. I politely asked him to move. He refused. Because um, my friend and I, we were sitting there first before them. So like I said, I, I was being polite and I wasn't being arrogant or anything or rude. I was just politely Asking him, this wrestling fan, to just please move. Because you're seeing my friend's seat. He got hostile with me. And whatnot. So, um, therefore, he, um, he got hostile. Started throwing things. But he didn't throw a chair directly at me. But he was just throwing the chairs and started talking all this crap about me, body shaming me, and that is not okay. I asked politely, and they continue, these wrestling fans continue to talk shit about me. And I was going to have it, so I told them to shut the up, and... um. I totally lost my cool cool two weeks ago because normally when I'm at these wrestling shows, I'm always in Michael mode and, you know, I get excited. I'm heckling at the wrestlers, but in this case, I lost my cool. I lost my cool on four wrestling fans because they kept on talking shit about me over and over and over again because I finally had enough. So I gave them some choice words. I told them, you can either either sit down and enjoy the show and keep your mouth shut or you can leave. Oh boy, they chose, they chose to leave. Because you know something, you know, you're here, you're here to um, watch the wrestling action, not talk shit about me. You know, I come to these wrestling shows, I, I have the right as a U.S. citizen to choose who I will cheer for and boo for. Who I will heckle at. And that's what I do. That's always been I do. I explain. I told you guys this. In, in my videos. Many years ago. And you guys know me. You guys know me by now. How I act at these wrestling shows. And, and what not. And I will not tolerate fans talking crap about me. 
And that goes for the wrestlers too. I'm not going to tolerate wrestlers talking crap about me in the back. Because us wrestling fans, we don't know what goes on in in that locker room. So, wrestlers, I expect the same thing. Don't talk crap about me in the back. If you got something to say, say it to my face. Don't go around talking crap about me behind my back. Because that's what I will not tolerate. I just want to get this out there so that I'm getting my point across. Now, on to this feedback video. My first favorite match of the evening was Ricky Love versus Nick Nelson. That was a great match. I really enjoyed it. Um, Ricky Love defeated Nick Nelson. My second favorite match was Zach Hendricks versus Josh Price. Now, that was a great match, folks. I really enjoyed that match. It was back and forth. I thought Zach was going to pick up the win. But that Josh Price, oh, my God. He just beat the crap out of this kid. So... So, you know what? Um, it was his first time facing Josh Price, but now he knows what Josh Price is all about. And the next time he faces him, the outcome will be coming his way. So, so shout out to him. He put, he showed great effort. And I respect this kid. So the next time you guys see Zach Hendricks, please show him some love because this, this kid is great. Great wrestler, great human being. And my last favorite match of the evening was, was Brian Blade versus Stonehenge in the Russian chain match. That was a great match. Oh, my freaking God. There was blood. These guys, these two beat the hell out of each other. And I really enjoyed that match. Brian Blade picked up the win fair and square. And Stonehenge, I don't, he was bloody up. And like I said, this is professional wrestling, and you're going to see blood, let me tell you. So, that's about does it for this feedback video. Be sure to follow me on Facebook at Michael Mo. okay? And always subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is MK Just Mike. It's all lowercase, so... Go on to the YouTube search engine and just put down MK Just Mike. It should pop up. It my YouTube channel should pop up right away. So, okay, and uh, the next um, MWE show is August twenty third. So it's gonna be in St. Louis Park. I will. Once they post the poster on the Midwest Wrestling Select Facebook fan page, I will, I will help promote that the upcoming show, and I'll play on my Facebook fan page, Michael Mo. Okay, so be on the lookout for that. Okay, well, well, I will talk to you guys later. Take care. And I'll see you guys in the next video.